Oh my god. 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 Hey everyone, it's Fantasia and welcome back to another episode of Modded Family. So Cove is angry and I don't know if she has any other mood to do with pregnancy because uh, I mean, it's very likely that she's pregnant at this point based on the last episode, but let's do our notification shout out and this one goes to Jason and I agree. I really think that Atticus would hate it too and maybe he would try something like a cigarette or something because he is being rebellious and I could see him. He's a preteen and I could see him like trying to like, you know, he got his hands on a cigarette somehow and he went and tried it or something. Maybe he even had a total derp and tried it in the bathroom and then Co found out because if you try it in the bathroom, I'm sorry, but you're going to get caught because that smell is going to linger and that's just a bad idea. Even if you open the window. <laughs> So, um, yeah, thank you so much for your comment. If you guys want a chance to be in a notification shuttle, all you gotta do is comment down below. So why is she so angry? How is she feeling today? So it still has that one. And then she has a sore throat from poor hygiene. What? Okay. Uh, <laughs> um, she has awful holiday. We already knew that. What should we do? Should we go to the doctor? I'm thinking so. I'm thinking so for sure. Oh, camp for Atticus starts. Ooh, ooh, okay. But let's do healthcare services. I mean, I guess we should just go for another appointment. Let's do it and let's see what the doctor says this time. So we're just gonna wait. I mean, can we go right now? We might be able to. Let's just try. Let's see. Yeah, okay, let's just go. Um, just to kind of get that out of the way. It's super early. I would say she has like an 8 a.m. appointment. Uh, I mean, no, we don't really need to take sick leave. I mean, she works in three hours. I feel like she'll be back in time. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe she won't be. Fingers crossed <laughs> that she is. Uh, yeah, go to appointment now. No, just go. Just go. Now she's going twice. Okay, it doesn't matter. Um, I'll click it off, but I'm going to leave it for now just in case something glitches out. That was weird. Um, so he, what did it say? He has to go to camp very soon. So I'm going to get him oh. awake. This is exciting. His first day of summer camp. Ah, I'm so excited. Um, I hope he has fun. I mean, it's sports camp, so I feel like he will. Oh, speaking of, we're supposed to get like a basketball hoop. We should do that. Um, you guys suggested that and I feel like that's perfect. Um, we can also put it in the front, which would make a little more sense because there's pavement here. So maybe we'll just have it in the front. Um, let's just get, should we just get black? Yeah. Okay. So now he has that. Obviously, I'm going to put it on this side because it is his, so. Okay, so I wish he could play now, but we're going to have to go. Um, so I hope he enjoys his day. I'm nervous for her, you guys. And then also, she has a sore throat, so I don't know if anything's going to happen with that. Oh my god. Oh, she has tonsillitis. Oh my god. She's been diagnosed with tonsillitis. Cove can fill the prescription for antibiotics via the online pharmacy. Let's treat with antibiotics. Is there going to be anything else? Maybe not. So then maybe we should go twice. I don't know. We don't have that much money and it costs 90 simoleons. But I want to hear something about the potential pregnancy. I can't believe she has tonsillitis. You guys. Oh my God. And look at her. She's just chilling. She's like, hey. Ooh. But I think she's going to start her period, I think. I'm irritated. She is on her period right now. Is she? Does she even have a tampon in? I have no idea. Um, I don't think she does. You do not. I feel like I need to get all the girls new pads and tampons. So let's go ahead and get her some. Oh, we should get this as like clutter. We should. Do we have any? I don't think so. I feel like I need to re-clutter the counters with like more things. Yeah, I feel like I had more on the counters, but then I got rid of some of the things that I had. Um, and then let's go ahead. What should we get? We'll just, I always get the ones with both. So we'll get that and then put it in her inventory and then open and unpack and then uh, unwrap and use tampon. Okay, so she's gonna use one and then you're awake as well. How are you feeling? Oh, oh, that's gonna go away soon though, that's good. And she just got a confidence boost. Okay, she's back from the doctor, but she's going again. So I don't know if, oh my God, girl, you're always so mad. I really hope we get told something about something to do with pregnancy. I don't know. I don't know, you guys. I'm like really impatient at this point. It better freaking, I don't know. I keep saying I don't want to spoil it, but it needs to hurry up. The game needs to tell me. Um, See, we still can't take a pregnancy test, 
But I don't know if that's because she found out at the doctor already. And, like, maybe the doctor won't tell her anything then. I don't know, you guys. Ah, I feel like she needs to work on her writing more. So let's go ahead and do that. I just really feel like she needs to be doing that more often. So let's go ahead and resume writing. She really, oh my god. What? <laughs> Are you? So now she needs to have her appendix removed? Go, ah. Okay, what is going on? She has tonsillitis. Now she needs her appendix removed. What is going on? Oh my god. Excuse me. Dealing with addiction. Let's continue that because you literally have been recovered for so long now and you're still not finished that book. Are you joking? I can't even click on her now. So, oh, there we go. So after this, she's gonna go to the hospital. Uh, is she gonna like, wait, what kind of mood? I never had this happen before. I wonder if she's gonna have like certain moodlets. Oh. <gasps> And like, if she's gonna need like pain meds and be needing to like rest. Oh my God. Oh, by the way, <laughs> this is his bedroom. Um, It's not done. So this is Blaze's bedroom so far. So I decided, you know, he's a little genius, right? So I thought I would get him this, but then I feel like, I don't know. Something makes me feel like he would just be really into the void critters. So, I mean, to me, this is like Pokemon for the Sims. I just feel like he'd be really into that and be into drawing. So I'm gonna be adding more stuff. I want something over here, but I thought it would be realistic to have his room like slowly progress. Um, So yeah, we will be adding more. We'll be adding some more here oh my god we got a pair of bills oh my god are you kidding oh uh, okay wait now uh aren't you supposed to go to the hospital girl do we need to like do that ourselves i don't know but she's going to work and she really shouldn't be i kind of feel like she shouldn't go like isn't that like yeah i really don't think she should be there yeah i really i just don't think so so hold on um like i said i've never done this before so if i do this again is there gonna be an option Go to the hospital. What? Guys, what's going on with this mod? Shouldn't she be able to go? I wanted her to be able to do this. Like she needs a surgery. I'm confused. And we didn't get told anything about anything to do with pregnancy. So are we not pregnant? Are we pregnant? I don't know. And I don't know if the whole appendix thing was even actually happening. I'm very confusion. He's sleeping in so long. Actually, it's only 11 a.m. And it is summer break. We're just gonna let him sleep. He went to sleep really late, actually. Oh, our power stop. Oh my gosh, we have a million. <laughs> oh my God, we can't have the bill. We need a loan. Oh, I don't think I, oh guys, I need to get the mod again that allows you to get loans. I don't think I have anything that will allow us to get a loan currently. So we're just stuck. Oh my god, what? Guys, I want to do it with a mod because this is modded. Oh my goodness. What? Sure. Sure. <laughs> and then now, like, okay, let's do laundry. Add a washing machine. So I have to get the mod again that allows me to get a loan. We're going to have to get on that. Um, and, um, mm -hmm. we can't even do the laundry because our bills. Oh my goodness. What are we going to do? They are like, oh crap, we need a loan. It would probably take a little bit. So I guess it's all right. They're kind of just stuck for this episode. So we're really out here experiencing the broke life. Like actually, <laughs> hold on. We do have fan mail. So I'm wondering if, uh, you know, we got some things in here that we could maybe sell. Who knows? Maybe we do. Can she take these yet? She can't. Whenever I have her open this, I feel like she's like not opening it. Like, I don't really know what is going on with that. Like, we can't even sell it. Is it glitched? Oh, maybe it is. It might be glitched. I Yeah, she keeps resetting. I probably need to update the mod. But anyways, do we have anything in here? We have some things to give us a little bit of money, but really not much. Guys, we're going to experience a whole thing. I should place down a bank and everything. We can go get a loan right at the bank. That would be interesting. We need to cure that. We haven't been doing that. So she really needs to like sell some more weed. I really wish she could like get some more clients. Wait, why can't he play with this? I mean, I know he doesn't um have cards but usually that's weird this is so weird if anyone knows why i can't click on this let me know that's super strange to me like everything else works it's just this this is literally an in-game thing usually you can click on it and you can even buy cards like through here i don't know but he's gonna go ahead and just experiment a little bit and maybe he'll do some drawing i really wanted to start this though that's annoying me you're a little bit hungry 
girl, I just want you to tell me if you're actually really pregnant. And I feel like she should probably get some medicine. Yeah. Oh, oops. Yeah. I feel like we should do that. So let's go back to healthcare services. Still very confused about like this appendix thing. Okay. Get out of the pool then. Also, we have like the stinkiest of trees. It's really great. It's really great. We were supposed to do stuff with this and then we didn't because this household is really hectic. <laughs> we constantly have something going on. So, uh, uh -huh. um, let's go ahead and order from the pharmacy. Oh, okay. Here we go. Okay. So you do get this one. Okay. Yeah. We'll go ahead and get that. Perfect. And we'll go ahead and have her take cold medicine and hopefully that helps her feel better. There we go. Okay. She needs to pee. Honestly, she should be resting, to be honest. Honestly, we can't even do cam girl work because she, we don't even have power right now. So I'm just like, she's feeling sick. Like, I don't know. It says keep in shape. So we could have, but see, she has bronchitis. I feel like she wouldn't. I honestly feel like she'd just have like some soup or something and then go lay down, you know? <laughs> Sushi. Oh my God. I love him or her. She does have the option to throw up. I think she's pregnant. Like, I mean, it's kind of obvious at this point. If she is and then she has bronchitis, you guys, I'm gonna feel so bad. I'm gonna feel so, so bad. Oh no, unbalanced meals. He's grungy. Should we go ahead and give some positive advice? Sure, let's do that. Okay, we just got 100 simoleons for that. Yay. <laughs> she gave her good advice. Okay, that's good. That's good. Um, Thank you so much. I will do exactly what you've told me. Ooh, you finished knitting. Oh my God, I feel like they are like dying right now. And they're just like, oh my God. Like they, I, I feel like they have an appointment tomorrow to get a loan and they're literally dying. Ah, oh, you stepped in pet poop? Oh no. Ooh. Oh, but she's not feeling well. I think we're just gonna go. I know she's not feeling well, but I feel like she hasn't seen him in a little bit and she may or may not be pregnant with his baby because I don't know who else she would be pregnant by. So I'm going to take a wild guess that it would be his. It's just weird because they haven't been seeing each other as often. Their relationship's just weird. It's always been weird. I mean, well, for starters, Cove is not even like a relationship kind of person. She's just not. I do think though, she will be settling down with someone as she gets older, but like, I don't know, you know, she's still young. Oh, you just sneezed on her. Her. Oh my God. She should not be out right now, you guys. But like, I don't know. I'm just, oh my God, Marcus is an elder. Oh my God. And has a spouse. How long has that been going on? Let me open this. Like, I don't know. They don't have any sentiments currently. Like I said, they haven't been seeing each other as long, but I mean, they, they does say they're soulmates and obviously they've been dating. I don't know if any of you guys remember that, but they did start dating. But their relationship's just weird because she's non-committal. So she's always like, she has so many traits, you guys. Also, she does not want to be pregnant. So that's going to be fun. Um, <laughs> but uh, yeah, and then she's a player. Like, I don't know. She's just such not a romantic person. And like when it comes to like serious relationships. So it's just like really hard for her. I feel like she never like reaches out to him to like hang out and stuff. It's like super just weird. But um, let's see. Stumpy flu. Oh, now you have the flu and you're literally out right now. And she's contagious. We definitely, we're going to make everyone sick. <laughs> oh no. Oh my God. No. Should she order more stuff? We literally have gone to the healthcare services like 20 million times in this episode. But yeah, we're going to do that again. She's around all these people. She's sick. She should not be here. Um, but let's see. So you have the flu now. This also helps with the flu. So I don't know if she should just get more. Um, but also I'm thinking, hmm, I'm thinking that she's also just going to get regular medicine. It might help like the medicine that comes in the game. I don't know. I'm going to have her take this first and see. Now she's just like high off that. <laughs> she really, oh my God. 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 Okay. Hold on. She's over medicated. Uh, so we're not going to take this right now. We'll take it tonight. But you guys, unwanted pregnancy from unprotected woohoo. Cove did not expect this pregnancy and it is really not sure that she wants it. <gasps> it's happening. And then we need to go to a prenatal appointment. Oh my God. She's in her first trimester. Did she get a bump yet? No, not yet. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Wait, I'm going to click on him. And then can we do anything with this? I definitely think she'd worry about putting on baby weight for sure. 
Um, we're going to announce unwanted pregnancy. I don't know if it's his. You guys. Oh, look at this. Look at them. Oh my god. What? Okay, I, guys, how are you feeling? How are you feeling? I don't know how to feel. She really is pregnant. I, I, I cannot. I mean, obviously, we kind of figured that out. But, like, the fact... I'm taking so many pictures. The fact that it's really happening now, she officially has the moodlet. He looks so mad. <laughs> oh, my God. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, um... Can we do anything here? Confess loving another. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh, you guys. Oh, now she's crying and now he's clapping. Oh, this is a whole freaking mess. This is a whole mess. Now she's shocked. <laughs> No. Oh my god. She's going through a whole bunch of emotions. What is this? Not on the same page. He's happy about it? Oh. So he's happy about this pregnancy? Huh. Oh my god. <laughs> all of a sudden she's all dazed. Oh. Guys, this. What if they break up because of this? I don't even know. I wonder how he would react if she discussed this with him. I'm curious. I feel like this would be on her mind right now. I don't think she's going to do that, but I feel. Oh. Oh. He does not like that idea. Look at her face. Look at her face right now. She's like, oh, this. Oh, oh my God. What? Did he say anything to that? What is going on here? I don't know. She's going to talk to this. I don't know, this girl, I don't know. Um, I don't think we got anything from that. But he did not like that idea. Because he wants a baby. Huh. I mean, she doesn't have a baby with him yet. Obviously, she had a baby with Dake. So, interesting. Interesting. This is gonna cause for a lot of drama, a lot of heat. Um, because this is really unexpected. Oh my god, he just aged up. Like, what the hell? They're on a date. This is- the this is the worst date of all history <laughs> it literally is um let's see discuss hopelessness share worries about pregnancy let's do that now she can't even get a drink because she's pregnant i feel like she would so want a drink right now that can't happen oh my god he's playing the guitar <laughs> you're so random he just aged up he's like oh yeah it's a party oh yeah and then we're having this situation. This is gonna be a whole thing. I don't know how this is gonna go, you guys. I really don't. This is so random and like she's sick. She's probably literally giving everyone the flu, but I'm gonna wrap this up here. Yep, we're ending it off just like this because uh, things are gonna get crazy. I don't know if she's having a girl or a boy. I'm already curious about that. Ah, uh, she needs some nails on for her swimwear, but you guys, what are you guys thinking? Comment down below. I'm very curious. And oh, by the way, side note, if you, if you watch all the way to the end, well then you're probably the only people who care about this anyways. I was going to say earlier in the episode, but I forgot. I just want to let you guys know that they will be staying together for this whole season. So even though um, we're going to have to kind of do a little bit of switcheroo stuff <laughs> um, to get Harlow an adopted child. What I'm just going to have to do is move her out. I'm going to obviously increase the household size with MCC, but to be able to actually adopt, I still need to move her out. So I'm going to move her out obviously with Carly for like the weekend, which right now it's Tuesday. So that's a little bit of time. I mean, we don't have to wait till the weekend. We can do it whenever. It doesn't have to be the weekend. It really, really doesn't. Harlow works from home. Yeah. So she can go over there in like a couple days and then we're going to adopt. And then basically I'll be like, I'll have the MCC set up to have more than eight Sims. And then, so all we'll have to do is just right click on the adopted child and add to family. So that's what we're going to do. Um, and yeah, so we will be able to have Cove have a baby and Harlow adopt. And, um, yeah, so that's going to happen. Um, and this whole season, we will keep them together. Season three, I have a lot of plans. I already have the name for it. So obviously eventually this household is going to become way too big to keep them together. Like I'm talking like when Atticus grows up and he might have kids, like this is a very much growing family. So eventually it's just going to be kind of unrealistic to keep them all in the same house. Like imagine we had one household with like 15 sims. That would be insane. So obviously eventually as the family keeps expanding, I don't want to end this series. So they're going to have to, I mean, we could still have some of them live with each other and then some of them in other households. Like, you know, that's just how it is when you have a growing um, 
family with different generations and all that. So eventually, yeah, season three, um, I have a lot of ideas, but I have some ideas where I think you guys would actually really like it in the way that I have planned for them to be like in different households. The way I'm planning to do it, I think you guys will really like it. But as for season two, we're still pretty early on into the season. I mean, we're like in the middle of it, I guess. Um, but there's still a long way to go for this season. They will be staying in the same household. Yeah, I just want to let you guys know that. But anyways, I'm going to wrap this up here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys are all having an amazing, amazing day. And don't forget to leave some positivity down below. I love you guys also so much. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Then